Hi guys, uh, welcome to Tech Info. Today let's learn diesel cycle with the help of this animation over here. Both the theoretical concept, practical concept and also the piston movements will be explained clearly in this topic. So let's start uh, the animation. The theoretical and practical concept is a PV diagram. That's a pressure volume diagram. Volume is coming in the X axis and pressure is coming in the Y axis. So theoretically, uh, we take into consideration that the cylinder is full of air initially, which is practically not possible. So in the practical graph, you can see one to two an air intake process is happening, which uh, involves a piston movement from top dead center towards the bottom dead center. So you can see the air intake process happening as the piston moves. In the stage two, you can see that adiabatic compression of air is happening in the theoretical concept. Adiabatic compression of air means no heat transfer is involved in this particular process. Theoretically, we can say that, but practically, an adiabatic process will not be there because heat transfer will def definitely be happening there. So, here you can see the piston moves from bottom dead center to top dead center while the compression is happening in 1 to 2 in theoretical stage and 2 to 3 in the practical stage. Piston reaches the top dead center. Now, the stage 3 from 2 to 3 a constant pressure combustion is happening a constant pressure combustion is also called as an isobaric process in 2 to 3 in theoretical concept and from 3 to 4 in the practical concept so both are isobaric process here it's a constant pressure combustion here also you can see constant pressure because when this uh, green line is extended towards the y uh, side you can see the pressure will be constant over there so that's an isobaric process and the piston will be at tdc at the at particular this stage now from three to four in the theoretical concept adiabatic expansion of air is happening no heat transfer is involved in this process while the air is getting expanded the piston moves from you can say like that the tdc towards the bdc and in practical concept from four towards 5 the expansion is happening as the piston moves you can see the practical concept also over there so at the end of this stage the piston will be at bottom dead center now we'll have the exhaust stroke which is a constant volume process it's also called as an uh, isometric process you can see the volume will be constant during the exhaust in the theoretical concept but in the practical concept that won't be uh, true you can see uh, in the practical concept it, it's from spanning from 5 to 1 when the piston moves from BDC to TDC so that's practically how it happens and theoretically how it happens so that's the diesel cycle I believe you understand the theoretical and practical concept of the diesel cycle and how the pistons move according to that so for more technical video updates you can subscribe to our YouTube channel you will get daily updates you can also uh, like our Facebook page or click the like button for this video or drop a comment if you have any doubt or to motivate us. Thanks for watching this video. Have a great day.